Shook it up. Good morning, lovely people. Today is Monday. It is the 21st of January. Dogs are being fed. I have done my hair, curled it, showered, got up, healthy morning routine. I am walking, which is good because the last couple of days I've been kind of limping around the place because I trained calves the other day and they ache now. They ache. I've got proper lactic acid doms and uh, I even cried having a bath and everything last night. I'm just walking around closing doors here. Today is Blue Monday. Apparently it is the most depressing day of the year, which it, I think if you put that label on a day, you're not going to feel very good, are you? So I say to hell with it being blue one day, we're going to have a good day. I'm up, I'm showered, I'm healthy, I can walk. What's to be blue about? I was meant to go to Pilates this morning, but I opted to curl my hair instead. So I'm going to go to Pilates tomorrow with less. Fresh day, fresh training. I'm still doing my high frequency training. I'm actually quite enjoying it, even if it is making me sore. Today I am going to be doing some quad work. I'm going to be doing some biceps. And I'm going to be doing some back. I am also going in to get my lashes infilled. I go to YLB in Shrewsbury. Danny does them. There is four girls in there. They're all super talented. They also do microblading and eyebrows and everything I related in YLB. So I'll link their Instagram down below. They really are very good. I was very wary of moving and moving away from Ursula who had previously been doing my lashes for three years. But look, this is after over two weeks and I still have a substantial amount. Sometimes they don't last as long, but that's more down to my wear and tear on them but they've lost quite well this time i've lost a few from kind of the outer sides so if you're looking for russian lashes um ylb lex goes to ireland again this week but i have him home today and tomorrow and he goes on wednesday until saturday so when he's away i plan on being super productive so i'm gonna get early nights early starts do loads of classes and I'm going to get back to doing more of my recipes. Gonna eat puppy yoga for the morning. Do you do yoga, Rox? No? Stalker. Stalker. I have had breakfast. Had some oats. I had coffee. So we just have a lot of dirty dishes going on. I was just waiting on my muscle food delivery to arrive before going to the gym. So I'm gonna unpack these, unbox them, take you through some of my favorite stuff some new stuff that's come in so you can see what you can get from muscle food because muscle food is a great option when you're trying to stay on track they have a lot of ready meals they have the best quality meat they have loads of high protein snacks they cater for all diets including noisy dog diets so like whether you're vegan, gluten-free, vegetarian, or you're like me, or you're a paleo diet, there is something for everyone. And they're quite affordable, delivered straight to your door. And you can elect a day to get it delivered. So if you're out all week and you're in on a Saturday, you can elect to have it delivered on a Saturday. And this is what I got. So I've unboxed all of the muscle food. Bailey's going a bit crazy. <gasps> Unbox all the most food and this is what I've gotten. This is a month's worth of food for me and Lex. We probably wouldn't generally get through all of it. So some of it goes on to the next month. But this is our freezer filler. We do have a spare fridge freezer in our garage that we put a lot of the meat in. So I've ordered a lot of the chicken breast mints because I have a few recipes that I want to record and I needed the chicken breast mints for these recipes. So I've ordered a bit of chicken breast mince, which will be going in the freezer. We've got some chicken breast, that's about five kg, and a lot of extra lean beef, which I use for bolognese, chilies, and burgers, the like, cottage pies. So a lot of them recipes are over on my channel already, especially the cottage pie. I've also ordered a boneless 
pork joint. Now this is a bit higher in fat because as you know me and Lexa are on a higher fat diet now so this is 7.1 grams of fat per hundred and then we also have some beef brisket which I've never tried before but it's meant to be really good. It's a really lean piece of beef. It's only less than a gram of fat per hundred and as you can see there is a bit of fat there on the side that's going to give it flavour but quite low in fat there for a lower fat meal. Moving on to breakfast we have some bacon medallions from me and we have this new naked bacon which is streaky bacon rashers that um, are perfect for Lex. I'll be able to fry them up with some eggs for him in the morning. Then we've got loads of egg whites because not only do I use these in egg white scrambles and adding them to egg yolks for scrambled eggs but also I use them a lot in my baking to keep the fat content low on my little treats because I want to keep them low calorie. I've sampled some of these so I've just gotten two meals just to try them out. I didn't want to get loads of them in case I didn't like them. This is the oriental pad thai with Asian vegetables. It has really good macros and this is perfect for me for a meal on the go. So for a meal it's 17.7 .7 grams of fat 16 grams carbs so really low carb and then 62 grams of protein in this meal so that is perfect for me for a day where I just don't have time to cook and then we've got this buffalo chicken with blue cheese and greens so that is going to be super tasty as you can tell with the blue cheese for the meal it's 14 grams of fat 10 grams of carbs again a low carb meal and then 53 grams of protein so these are perfect if you're a very busy person if you work late something like that you can bring it into work stick it in the microwave and it just keeps you eating healthy keeps you on track they do bundle deals on these as well so if you get five of them i know you get a discount so perfect for lunches and dinners in work then i've got my eat lean cheese you can get these in a lot of supermarkets but i usually get them in my muscle food delivery and they are perfect for adding to sandwiches pizzas pastas all that kind of jazz and then i got some of the block cheese for my toasted cheese sandwiches these again i've showed these before they're my favorite on the go chicken snacks if you just don't have time to be cooking up loads of chicken it's handy you can keep them in the freezer and then defrost them or keep them in the fridge they have quite a long expire date they have like two weeks left on them so i'll probably just keep them in the fridge for convenience for when I pop out. So again some healthy fats, we've got some smoked salmon and I am quite fussy about my smoked salmon because I'm Irish and we do really good smoked salmon but this one is really good and I'll have it with scrambled eggs on a bagel and squeeze of lemon yummy then i wanted to try these again i tried one of these before and i thought they were pretty good so i've just got three of them just to see if i genuinely do like them we've got the brave snacks which i've showed you before they are a roasted pea snack i know it looks like a small portion but they actually are quite substantial macros pretty good on them four grams of fat 15 grams of carbs again perfect for your handbag or your gym bag or whatever for on the go lex loves cashews so i just topped up his cashews they also do coconut flour which i bake with a lot because i tend not to use regular flour keeping the carbs low in a lot of my recipes i'm trying to keep them gluten free so i really like baking with this we've got the fulfilled salted caramel bars they're yummy and they're available for muscle food lex really likes these protein waters i'm not a fan of rhubarb flavored things but they have a lot of protein in them no fats or carbs which is rare for flavored water but 20 grams of protein so they're just handy for him to be supping on throughout the day and then we got some granola i just add about 10 grams of this to my yogurt just to make it a little bit more fancy and these are gluten-free they have pretty good macros for like about 10 grams you're going to get 2.4 grams of fat 4.0 9 grams of carbs and 1.4 grams of protein and literally 10 grams is enough on top of the yogurt just to give it that little crunch and make it a little bit extra special so as you know i have been working with muscle food for about four years now i love their products i don't work with a lot of companies but i do love muscle foods products and the service that they provide to us while we're trying to get healthy it's handy to have healthy food at your fingertips you can choose the day it's going to be delivered the meat products are above and beyond what you would get in a supermarket and that is my main thing with muscle food is that the chicken breasts when you cut them down they don't shrink they stay big and plump because they don't inject water into them they don't have to do any of that eye candy that a lot of supermarkets have to do to entice you into buy them you get exactly what it says on the tin with muscle food so now i'm gonna have to spend the next 10 minutes trying to find space in my freezer and fridge to put all this stuff away 
I'm gonna bring the dogs on a quick walk and then I'm gonna head to the gym. And I'm walking, look, walking. I wasn't able to walk yesterday, I was limping. I walked around Aldi and people probably thought there was something severely wrong with me. But I'm on the mend today because I had that two day doms yesterday and today they're starting to wear off. So as long as I keep movement in the legs, when I sit down they kind of cramp up again. You know the feels, you know the feels, you work hard and then you get punished for it. So I'm in from the dog walk looking reasonably dishevelled, my hair lacking the luster it once had and I'm going to have a nice creamy coffee and a homemade high protein red velvet cupcake. The recipe for these is over on my cooking channel so go check it out. I am going to be working on a lot of new recipes this week which will be going up in the coming weeks. So you've that to look forward to. fresh lashes on and look how mega they are they just make me feel like I've got makeup on even when I don't my hair is a bit disheveled it's gotten really cold outside and I'm hungry so I'm gonna have these as you saw on my haul and these should keep me going and I'll probably have coffee as well it's about 6 p.m. and then I'm gonna get on with dinner and that is me done for the day then full day it's been good video here guys I hope you enjoyed my content hit up the link below for muscle food if you're interested in purchasing comment down below with suggestions for videos you'd like to see me make in the next coming weeks catch you next time because if I only had a hundred fans I take them all to dinner talk about the people that we used to be 